just learned that Duval County Public Schools is extending spring break through March 22nd. And they've been giving out some more information too relevant to parents. Robert Bradfield is live with what this means for families. Robert? Yeah, good evening here. Dr. Diana Green said this was a tough decision, however, one that needed to be made, and she says she does sympathize with those families who are now likely going to be home with their children, possibly for another week. That's because Duval County Public Schools has extended their spring break through March 22nd. So again, all next week, students and staff will remain home. We can tell you also that Dr. Diana Green says she does plan to meet with principals tomorrow to get a better understanding on how they do plan on cleaning the school schools, but she says these schools will receive a deep clean. There is one exception to this closing rule, and I want to mention this because Dr. Diana Green says there are five high schools that will be testing students for the SAT tomorrow. Those five high schools will in fact continue with the SAT testing tomorrow. So if students were planning on doing those tests, uh, Dr. Diana Green says those tests will still be on. Also do want to mention that all field trips have been canceled. Also all athletic events have been canceled as well, but Dr. Diana Green again saying this was a tough decision that needed to be made. Listen here. With the unknowns associated with student and family travel outside the continental United States and cruises over spring break, and with daily changes in guidance from healthcare officials on who should self-isolate, it is imperative that we take time to assess our capabilities to safely open our schools. Again, that was Dr. Diana Green a short time ago. She also mentioned that for parents, teachers, students, any faculty members that may have taken a vacation outside of the continental United States during this past spring break, she wants those students and staff members to also self isolate themselves for 14 days. She did go on to say that as of right now, they do not have a specific number of those folks that fall into those categories. Again, parents, uh, teachers, students, in fact, again, outside of the continental United States that may have taken vacation, but she says she is looking into that and that actually by next week could top several hundred. So again, she is looking into that. Those folks again need to self isolate. We will have more information regarding this decision here from the Duval County Public Schools. All new for you tonight at 530. Jeannie, Anthony, much. back to you. Appreciate